Beaten and bloody, brand new video now on 1111 showing what may have led to a melee on Fountain Square. People cheering after a man is knocked to the ground. You see that we're blurring the video because it is so graphic. Evan Millward on your side now taking the video to police. He's live on Fountain Square where it all went down nearly 24 hours ago. Evan? Yeah, Julie and you at home, you may have already seen this video. It's got hundreds of thousands of shares on Facebook. A scene here so out of control it brought police out in riot gear as some people launched fireworks at them last night. And that cell phone video shows what might have started it all. Again, I'll warn you, we are blurring and bleeping the majority of this footage. Covered in blood, people laugh as he lays almost motionless. This man, an innocent bystander, according to police, Help him up. Help him up. Get him to the attacked in the middle of thousands of people, many families in the heart of downtown Cincinnati. Everybody started running, and uh, there was fireworks thrown towards the police officers, and uh, it was just really wild. Our cameras also catch the scene as paramedics arrive to help and families flee as officers in riot gear close in. Bad as it was, I thought that there might be gunshots or something like that. Sunday, police confirmed this video is the same scene, a fight that spilled over quickly getting out of control. Police also defending their response. People got injured, so it didn't it wasn't perfect, but yet we had to react to the uh, the attitude and the efforts of the crowd and I think it was handled quite well. In all, seven people were arrested. Police say this man, Jai Britton, punched an officer responding to the melee. All quiet Sunday night on Fountain Square before thousands packed in to catch the World Cup game. No extra security added. And with just days before baseball's best move in, Get us some water, eh? some water. police say they're confident this won't be a problem again. So we feel as though we are well prepared for the safety of anybody and understanding there is some concern because of this, but we are very much prepared for the, uh, the tens and hundreds of thousands of people that will be coming downtown for the All-Star festivities. And an update for you about the man you saw on the ground in that video. Captain Neville with Cincinnati PD tells us just hours ago the man had serious injuries, some internal, but tonight he is out of the hospital. And we're live in Fountain Square tonight. I'm Evan Millward, 9 on your side.